last day. Well, this morning I threw the cards real quick here, and I the question was, uh, what's it going to be like when we pass through this sexual dynamic that we've been going through with all this <laughs> drama, with this, you know, the revelry and all the, the stuff uh, with all that. So what it comes out to is that uh, this past uh, burden that's been carried, okay, is going to go and we will enter a new thing of that more respect for women that there will be more fulfillment women will feel more fulfilled more secure uh and that again this uh they will enter a better place of power i think well, it's not going to make the men feel secure when we got her standing there holding a head. But <laughs> no, we're not going to become headhunters. Okay, relax. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. <laughs> but it's basically once we get through this cycle of all this stuff and mankind gets their head on straight, you know, again, that burden will be lifted and it will go into a new understanding, you know, uh, of a balance you know she'll come more to the power that she should be in and there will be more fulfillment there okay that there will be that revelry okay so as long as i've got this open i might as well do the uh real quick cards on um <clears throat> on about this fight or flight you know, uh, this is also the other stage we're in right now, this fight or flight. Um, <clears throat> so will this fight or flight uh, and all of these, uh, what do you want to call them? Um, oh, there's a word for that. Hmm conspiracy theories will these conspiracy theories finally rectify and come to some end when we get through this cycle will these conspiracy theories and dramas come to an end when we get through this cycle now, how long this cycle is going to take us to get out of here, I don't know. We'll see, but it's, uh, yeah, it's just, uh, it's been crazy. It's been really crazy with all this stuff, okay? So, let's see what happens. First card out is... <clears throat> card of balance yin yang uh, it's a and again it's the knave or coming forth with the message of balance uh, what we have prior is men with the uh, chalice <clears throat> which they like to bring up with the emotions okay emotions and okay we have the, the uh, guys that are secure in the financial things. Uh, okay. So I think that this has to do with uh, either Putin or Trump or Putin and Trump. Okay. When these things come to balance, it looks like Putin and Trump. Uh, that they are really fueling these things, Putin and Trump, okay? Because it's kind of, we've got this card, we've got Putin looking towards Trump. <laughs> and this is the card of like balance, but they are spinning it to the negative, not to balance, okay? But what we have above this is why I'm thinking this has to be Putin and has to be Trump is again, 
we've got that card of strength, that going forth, and this heart heartache uh, going in. So I think that once we get through all this drama with um, <clears throat> Putin and uh, get rid of Trump and break that Putin-Trump connection, that these things uh, are going to maybe right themselves. But let's see if it does right themselves when we get to that, because this is holding it in place. It's that strength of that heartache. You know, they keep sending out that energy of heartache, okay? This is what they're doing. They are sending out, Putin is sending out all these nefarious things, okay? That energy, putting it out there of that pain and that, you know, all of these conspiracy theories and dramas, okay? So when they break this Putin and uh, when they break this Putin and uh, Trump alliance, Will this settle down? Will this settle down? Because it's just, it is so bad now. There are so many conspiracy theories. And this latest new Trump lawyer with this trying to say, oh, the FBI is setting him up and they are, you know, it's, it's horrible. So let's see what we have. When they break this Putin and Trump alliance, will things change? Will things change once we get that alliance broken? Will things settle down? Let's see what we have. The world. So let's see what's going to happen in the world. This is concerning the world. Then we got Russia again. <laughs> We got Putin again, and he's, it's going to slow his stuff down. He's still there, the ego, writing the ego thing, usually in Buddhism when they're on this uh, kind of a thing, this cow, this stubborn bull, this ego, but it's going to be slowed down. Looks like it's going to be slowed down. What's under it is there is going to be, uh, yeah, there's going to be more looking, looking to see what's actually there. So resurrecting more into looking deeper at what's there, which is going to cause this to slow down. Doesn't mean it's going to end, but it's going to be pushed, pushed way back, pushed way back from where it's at now. Yeah, because he's still looking to do it. He's, he's not going to... He's not going to stop. He's still looking to put, you know, dominate the world. That's where he's at. He's looking to dominate the world, and he will do it by nefarious means. Slowly by slowly, he will keep putting it into place. But we will start getting a little smarter and looking, looking for the light deeper and getting that wisdom, okay? Getting that, uh, putting that energy forward to looking deeper. Okay, uncovering what's hidden. So they're going to put that energy forward to uh, uncover what's there a little better. Thank God, because it's just, it's really so bad with these uh, negative spins. So let's see and say here, uh, what is the best advice to give people to approach these uh, uh, conspiracy theories. What is the best advice for people to see concerning all these deep conspiracy theories? What is the best advice for people to have concerning these conspiracy theories? So let's see what we have what it says, okay. Oop. <laughs> no, there's nobody there, Goose. 
Oh my God. There they go again and there's nobody here. <laughs> okay, let's see what we have. Oop. It's not easy to put them back. They're slippery little buggers. Ooh, somebody ran away. Who ran away? Oh, okay. You run away? Okay. Who's away is the one with the shield. Okay. So let's see how he figures in there. First one out. Hey! Oh. There's nobody there. There's nobody there. Barking doorbells. Hey, barking bells. There's nobody there. Come on, you two crazy boys. Oh my goodness, they're so bad. So the middle thing is about the truth, about the strength of the truth, and we need to, you know, again, uh, bring that forward. Oh, okay, what's, this is it, okay, yeah. Let me, ooh, 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 okay. Okay, so the best advice I can give you concerning these things that you're hearing, Okay, to understand <laughs> that you need to come forward with your shield. You have your shield up. Understand your energy, your shield up to be looking at these things. Raj, quit. There is nobody there. Come on, you two, quit. And what happens is, above it, is this is something that they are working on. They're implanting, they are growing, they're putting it out there and there needs to come an end. Understand, just don't pay attention to it. Let it die. They keep manufacturing and grow this and you need to see it as death, okay? Don't have any interaction with these things, okay? Because they are What's before it is it's all fantasy. It's there to draw you in. It is there to draw you in and it's there to shake up your world. Okay, to make it fall. To throw you off balance. But it's not true. It's not true. Okay. It is made by someone that doesn't have your best at heart. It's not genuine, okay? It's not genuine, okay? So understand these things are manufactured. They've been grown and it's something you need to put an end to. Nip it, don't go there because it's all illusion there to draw you in to absolutely destroy. Okay, so keep your guard up, okay? Keep your guard up. People are so, you know, this is the thing you see, they're so taken in by these things, by these dark forces. And what they're there to do is to divide and conquer. Okay, they're not out looking for your thing. And all this idea about the deep state and this and that and the setup and they're going to take away your second right amendment and all these things, these are the dark forces out there to absolutely skew your world. And none of that is true. It's there, again, to uh, cause hate and division and fear. And if they can keep you in fear mode, if they can keep you looking for a boogeyman around the corner, then they can sneak in, destroy your world, and take over, okay? It's that simple. So don't buy in, and please, like I tell everybody who wants to bring all your conspiracy theories here, do not put it on my channel, okay? because it is not coming from light at all. It is not truth at all. It has come from the father of lies. It is satanic, it is dark, it is disinformation. It is bogus, okay? And it's there simply to tear you down and to enslave you rather than to free you, okay? This is the path of light and freedom 
Okay, I'm a teacher of light to bring light and wisdom to help, help you to free yourself rather to become more enslaved. And all of those dramas are there to enslave. So they have no place here. Okay, so namaste. Thank you for tuning in. Bye.